these guys will take over at the 25-yard line. Well, that's unfortunate because he had a nice run going, but give credit to the defense. They got a hand in the cookie jar there, CD. You have to think about vision, finding a place to get down after you know you've gotten all you can out of a run, and obviously ball security is paramount. In today's football, everyone's coming after the rock. You've got to make sure you protect it and protect the yardage you just gained. no chance of turning the corner he can only get back to the line of scrimmage second and ten coming up and they'll keep leaning on the running game back to the ground and he'll be upended at the 28 yard line just a three yard gain there just not a whole lot of room to operate there on that carry. No, not at all. They did a really nice job staying in their proper places and not allowing any lanes to open up. Back to throw. Howell. He's going to loft one deep left side here. And that will fall incomplete. Oh, they took a shot there on what will turn out to be the final play of this first quarter. We're scoreless after one. So still a scoreless game in the first, but they're going to go for this thing on their own side of the field on fourth down. He's going to try and go deep again. He's got it at the 15. And all the way in for a Miami touchdown. Puka Nakua, 72 yards. And the Dolphins post the first points of the ball game as they take the lead here in this second quarter. Al now to throw it. Oh, he tries to force it in, and it's intercepted. Well, there's some excitement, right? Go for two, and instead it gets picked off. And how about the return? Give him a lot of credit, though, for not giving up after the play. Yeah, the troops rally. Exactly, and getting back there and making the tackle and not giving up two points themselves. This fielded right at the goal line. And he'll get it up past the 20 to about the 22. So back onto the field come the Pats for their second drive. Charles, you've got to think the number one goal here is ball security. Remember, last drive they coughed it up. Then they allowed the touchdown, and now they're trailing on the scoreboard. Boy, the way you described it makes me think that that one actually hurt them three times. The fumble cost them potential points. Then they watched their opponent get a touchdown off of the fumble. And third, they lost the lead as a result. Really tough sequence right there. I don't think coaches have to remind them to hold on to the football. They've just got to find a way to get it done. Richardson to the air on first down. It fights him off. But in the end, the pressure too great, and he goes down. Like the footwork back there, I thought he did a pretty good job of evading that first wave of players. Tried to buy a little extra time out of the pocket, but in the end, oh, that was a tough one. Yeah, winds up getting buried for the loss. Here's Richardson to throw. He's got it to Williams. And able to get this one across the 45 before he's brought down. 157 to go in this first half on EA Sports. First and 10, Richardson looks to throw it. Finding Williams once more, complete. It'll be a gain of just a yard, and that's going to bring up second down. But Richardson has to get them to the line in a hurry now. Now this one to his tight end out on the right side. And he's got another first down as he's brought down at the Dolphins' 30. A good pick up there, a 22. So first and 10 now from the 30. Richardson looking to throw. 
It's a short one here, complete to his tight end. And just three yards on the catch there. He couldn't get away. And that'll make it second down. I don't care what sport you're playing. Everyone likes to build up a little momentum, don't they? And look at this, back-to-back -back completions to the big target at tight end. That one not as profitable as the other, but still a decent game. And Richardson looks to throw once more. Throwing quickly there, but it's incomplete. But there's an incompletion, partner, and the struggles through the air continue because so far their lack of passing production has led to a lack of points. And he's going to be taken down here. A sack back at the 32. And now that brings up fourth down there, a loss of six yards on the sack. So not only do you not get the first down, but you've also made things a lot more difficult on your field goal kicker. Yeah, they're still in range, but you're exactly right because you know the kicker's over there saying, thanks a lot, you just made my job a little tougher because when he kicks it now, he'll kick it lower because he's got to get more distance. That means there's more jeopardy for the ball to get tipped or blocked. And partner, a lot of kickers in this spot like to aim at the right upright and just draw it back down the center. This one looked like it was aimed at the left upright and just kept bending away. Pal to the air on first and 10. He'll let this go deep for Waddle. It, oh, this is taken in. It's complete. Touchdown. Jalen Waddle in the final seconds of the first half. And the Dolphins would extend their lead here just before halftime. Oh, they pitch to the tight end. It's a fake. And this fake extra point attempt failed big time. Not only did they not get it, they went backwards. Uh, let me go ahead and show my age a little bit. I liked it when they would fake it from the three-yard line, right? When you'd line up, go ahead, and oh, there's a fake, and oh, he's going to get two. That's great. But from the 15, the risk-reward is just not there. So risky to get 15 yards on a fake. Well, you see the result right there. Yeah, I know these young whippersnappers are trying to do different things in this game, but let's go back to old reliable. Kick the ball through the post. Get off my lawn. <laughs> That's darn right. He'll take the knee in the final couple seconds. We'll tick by in this first half. That's it. For there you have it. Halftime quickly over. Third quarter, here we go. The Dolphins in front, and they'll be in possession of the football first as the second half gets started. A solid return, pretty good field position. They'll start at the 32. First down Miami as they get set to start the drive. This offense set to begin the third quarter, and Charles, if they had a checklist of things they wanted to accomplish in the first half, certainly at the top of that list would be having the lead, and they've got that here. That's always the most important box to check, isn't it? But also, they've had some success in their passing game, so probably an empty box establishing the run. They're on pace for fewer than 100 yards in this one, so now they want to make sure that they get that going so they truly have a control in this ball game, and down the stretch, being able to be balanced, either throw it or run it, and try and win this ball game. Well, come to the line here, needing nine yards to pick up the first. Powell throwing on third down here. Going for the deep ball. This is caught inside the 15. They're able to convert on third down, and that sets up a first and goal. Boy, this has just been an offensive clinic. It's seemingly been one big play after another, after another, and add this one onto the list. When you and he takes it into the end zone for the Dolphin touchdown. Taking it in from two yards out. And the Dolphins come right out of the locker room and score here in the opening minute of the third quarter. They're going to keep it on the ground. And he will get into the end zone to extend the lead by two more. So this time the conversion is good after a pair of failed two-point tries, Charles. They're one for three now. And you would figure with three touchdowns scored, your minimum number of points would be 21, right? Three extra points. And as you noted, they went for two twice, didn't get it. Went here again. This reminds me of something a coach told me a while ago. They have more two-point plays on their ready sheet nowadays than ever before. It used to be like one or two. Now most teams have up to six or seven that they have at the ready. 
And here comes a return from just beyond the goal line. And only able to get this to the 19, so probably should have opted for the touchback. So here are the Patriots now. They get ready for their first possession of half number two. They'll try and get the run game going. This is Henry. Fights forward for only about a yard up to the 21. Second and nine now from the 21. Now it's Richardson. Able to hook up with Williams here on the out route. And he'll go down just shy of the 25 at the 24-yard line. This offense in desperate need of a conversion as they come up on third down. Back to throw. Here's Richardson. A short throw to Conklin, the tight end. And they'll bring him down one yard shy after a pickup of four. I thought they might take a shot down the field, but instead they ran a little drag route there. I think they were hoping he could catch it and run away from the defender. But a really good job keeping the play in front of them, and they force a fourth down. Pulled in at the 24. A good return there, call it 13 yards. And it'll be Dolphin football. Out comes the Dolphin offense now as they get set to take over here. And now you've got the clock winding down here in the third quarter. Your three scores to the good. What's your approach on this drive? Too early to fully commit to playing the clock game. Yet at the same time, you're also not going pell-mell like you would in two-minute offense. This is what NFL offenses call four-minute football. Take the clock out of the game a little bit, wind it down, but at the same time, keep advancing the ball down the field. And that's going to be incomplete. Good effort there, trying to take a shot, but it's third down. Oftentimes when you're losing a game and the team's still throwing with this kind of a lead, you start playing a little more physically. And they took that opportunity right there to be... And the defense, they get to Howell. He'll go down here. Say hello to Eric Kendricks. He gets the sack there. And that was a passer's nightmare. The front door totally shut down by the defense. So he kept going backwards, hoping to find another avenue of escape. It didn't exist. He'll let this go deep for Waddle. And that's caught inside the 35. A big play there for the Dolphins. 67 yards. So a moment to catch our collective breath after the fourth down conversion. You are watching Madden Ultimate Team on EA Sports. This offense continues to be a hot knife through butter. Three drives, three scores, and knocking on the door again on drive number four. They'll try to run this one in. And he will push his way forward down to about the three-yard line. Only a yard that time, second and goal. They'll try again. And he will take it in for a Dolphins touchdown. A three-yard touchdown run as his guys are able to push that lead out a bit further. So, partner, it was a passing game that drove them down the field, but when they get close, they trust that man in the backfield, and he took them home. And they trust their offensive line as well because so many of these units, they specialize in either pass protection or run blocking. This group shows his versatility and gets both done on this drive. So now the Dolphin offense will stay out there as they'll go for two. Powell. Intercepted. Picked off by Adrian Phillips. It's interesting that when it comes to two-point conversions, even heavy run teams tend to throw the ball in these situations. In this case, this one was intercepted. Yeah, they weren't fooled. They were ready for the pass. Picked it off. And this is secured by the Patriots. And that's why you have your hands team out there on the field. Those are the best guys ready to make that play. And let's face it. It was executed well. It wasn't a bad kick. It wasn't anything like that. Just that the normal outcome actually came to play. Analytics would tell you it's a very low possibility of getting the ball for the team kicking it in an outside kick situation. You're all about the numbers, aren't you? All about the numbers, baby. It's a new game now. They don't lie. So not quite a first down just yet as they come up on second and less than a yard. Richardson. Going to be taken in here by Nakua. And he will reach the eight-yard line before going out. Call that a very strong gain of 24. Looking to throw. Richardson. And he's got it. 
Nice gain of eight that time, and it's second and goal. Just two minutes remaining here in the fourth quarter of what has been a one-sided affair. So the Patriots with the football as we get you reset. Another shot from the one on second and goal. Again, it's Richardson. In trouble, and he'll go down back at the 12. This will cost him 11 yards there on the second and goal sack. And you hate to say it with a rookie quarterback. He's done some good things, but overall, looked a little bit overwhelmed back there, hasn't he? He certainly has. But in his defense, he hasn't had a lot of time to throw the football. You like the way I said that? In his defense. In his defense. I got it. You yeah. see what I did there? And this is going to be intercepted. Trent McDuffie with a pick. And the Dolphins are going to take possession here as they've got it at their own four-yard line. Third and long that time, he was trying to make something happen, but a little too risky. Well, the field tilted on him. And what I mean by that is what you said, third and long. Got to push it downfield to try to pick up the first down. Defensive backs live for this situation. And they took advantage of the young man right there. On first down, Hal. And he whips that one incomplete there. The CD, they're up big, but they're still passing it. I mean, this is an offense that's had a lot of success in this game, and it seems like they're just having fun out there. And it does feel like there's been a shift out there, doesn't it, partner? Listen, if you're up, you can continue to do what you want to do. It's up to the other team to make you change how you do things. They'll continue to throw it around until stopped. Throwing here, Howell. And he fires one, but incomplete. Well, they're up comfortably here, Charles, but that lead certainly not dissuading them from pressing the envelope late. I mean, if anything, with these passes, it's like they're getting more aggressive to try to drive the ball downfield. And that will certainly lend itself to some post-game questions for that coach, and maybe you and I should have 10 that. A fight for it, and this is caught. It's caught indeed. Fourth down conversion plays, you usually think one, two, three yards, maybe 10. Not there. What a huge pickup as the sticks make a drastic shift forward. So how about this for a change in field position? From inside the 10, here's first down on the other side of the field. Oh, it's a screen pass. That's complete. And he'll go down here at the 35-yard line. Give him maybe a yard, quite the opposite from the previous big gainer. And once more, Hal back to the air. And again, he'll find Gronkowski complete. So the screen good for only two. Now it's third down. So a victory here for the Miami Dolphins. And this was truly a total team effort, Charles, on both sides of the ball. Well, they absolutely pitch a shutout, so it can't get much better than...